Hi, I'm Jim Lisinski, Clinical Associate Professor of Marketing at North University's Kellogg School of Management and co-author of the book, The AI Marketing Canvas, along with my friend and colleague, Professor Rajkumar Venkatesan. In our book, we explore two basic thoughts. One is, what exactly is artificial intelligence? You know, it's a word that's sort of a hot buzzword. Uh, it conjures images of sci-fi movies like The Matrix. But what really is it? And the second topic we tackle is, how do you get started? If you're a marketer and you want to apply artificial intelligence to your marketing, how do you even do that? It sounds scary and daunting. So just maybe a short thought on both of those two things. What is artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence is the broad field of study of how machines, systems, computers can act in human-like ways. And a subset of artificial intelligence that we really care about when it comes to marketing is called machine learning. It's how machines, how computer systems can ingest data, what computer scientists call training data, and then use that, use that training data to make highly accurate forecasts or predictions. And so marketers might often think about like, well, I'm not in the prediction or forecasting business. Maybe people trying to predict the weather on the news are in the forecasting business, but I'm a marketer. I'm trying to connect my goods and services, my brand, to consumers or buyers who might need that brand. But if you think about it for a minute, as we write in the book, that is actually predicting. You're trying to predict what is the right product at the right price, at the right place, at the right time that you want to put in front of the right consumer. So right there, that was five sort of predictions or forecasts, even in that little simple marketing example that you as a marketer have to make. So how have we done that? Well, historically, we've used our experience, our intuition, our gut for many years as marketers to do that. And more recently, we've used uh, some sets of data to assist us in making those kinds of predictions, spreadsheets, um, website visit data, Google Analytics data, what have you, to try and predict what should be the next thing that I do to my customers to help grow my brand as a marketer. So that's all great to do it as a human assisted by data, but if you really have a man versus machine, human versus machine partnership and apply uh, the subset of artificial intelligence that we call machine learning, you can make some great predictions and help delight your end customers and grow your own brand and grow your own business. So how do you get started? Well, I think often people believe like, oh, well, I have to create these fancy algorithms myself or hire a floor full of Stanford PhD computer scientists or something like that. And that sounds hard and daunting. But what we found in the research for the book is actually many of the business partners that I bet you're probably already working with, the Facebooks, the Googles, the Pinterests, the Instagrams, maybe your email vendor, even MailChimp if you're a small business, uh, already has the ability to make machine-powered AI predictions about your business. So let's take email for a minute. Uh, when should you send that email out? Should you send it on Sunday night or Monday morning? What should the subject line look like? What should the image look like uh, when people open the email? Well, um, these email systems now have the ability for no incremental cost to you as a marketer to take learning from all of the previous emails that you've sent and other email vendor e email companies have sent and make a prediction as to what's the right time that that email should be sent, not for everyone, but for each individual recipient. So now you're not marketing to the average, you're marketing to the individual. And that has the potential to delight your customers and unlock a whole lot more business value for you. So again, based on our book, The AI Marketing Canvas, two thoughts I'd like you to leave you with. One is think about you as a marketer being in the prediction business, and that's what uh, machine learning does really well. So think about how you can adopt it and the way to get started is to work with your existing business partners and vendors, like my email example, to see how could I use the email uh, machine learning powered options that they probably already have for no incremental cost to predict and deliver
better email or marketing outcomes for you and for your consumers.